Hello. If you're watching this, chances are you're an interpreter, or perhaps you're an interpreting student. And I want to tell you about a really good new resource for um, uploading and exchanging practice material. It's a website called SpeechPool. You'll find it at www.speechpool.net. And you can also find SpeechPool on Facebook. There's a dedicated page which you can like to get progress reports. And there is also a Twitter feed. I think that this is a website that could be really useful to interpreting students, but also to graduates who are still brushing up on their interpreting skills. Or I think it will be useful for people adding a language to their combination or working on a retour. And I want to tell you how far we've got with this website. The English version of the website is already available. It's out there on the internet at speechpool.net. We also have a Greek version of the site and a German language version of the site. And we're going to be rolling out the language versions one by one. So next week or in a couple of weeks, we should have Italian, we should have French, we should have Spanish. And after that, we should have Arabic and Russian and Macedonian, Portuguese, Estonian, Bulgarian, <laughs> Hungarian, and more than 30 language versions. Because behind the scenes are uh, a whole lot of people working on translating the content into all these languages. What else can I tell you about the speech pool? Um, if you want to use it and view the speeches, visit speechpool.net. You will need to register because some people don't want their face to be splashed all over the internet, so you need login details. And if you want to upload a speech, then please register and send us a little email to obtain permission to do that. And what you will need is a laptop or a tablet computer or a video camera. You record yourself, you upload it onto YouTube, and then it's easily transferred onto the SpeechPool site. Now, I think that it will be obvious to you already that a degree of altruism is needed in the SpeechPool project because it's not going to work if everybody just wants to view speeches. They need to participate and upload speeches as well. So you can see that it's very much the principle of you scratch my back and I'll scratch your, your back. Altruism or enlightened self-interest anyway. Some fun features of speech pool now. You can vote on the difficulty of the speech. It's a bit like TripAdvisor, where there's a star rating. So we'll come to a cumulative assessment of how hard speeches are. You can also have your say about the quality of the speech. If you think that the sound or image is very poor, or the content is badly structured and delivered, you can click on a big red button, and that will send an email to the administrators, and we'll delete the speech. And because we hope it'll be an interactive place, a place with a rapid turnover of speeches, you can go to the Facebook page and uh, enter a bit of a wish list there. So you could, for example, leave a comment saying, could somebody please upload a speech in Bulgarian about renewable energies? So those are some of the fun features of the site for you, we hope. Now, the best thing that you can do is visit the site. Please give it a trial run, because we've designed it, and now we're in the process of trying to identify bugs in the system and fix don't even think about the spiders bug fixing so that's the stage we're at now please visit the site join in with this experiment in collaboration in altruism i really hope that it'll be a very successful resource that you will find useful thank you very much